How are you all doing? How are you? We just got back from Tokyo, literally last night about 6 p.m. Went to bed about 9 p.m. and therefore had a fabulous day today. I woke up at half five this morning, bright and early, feeling nice and refreshed. I'd love to be a person that can wake up at half five every morning and feel great, but alas, I do not. But today I did. I went outside, watered the plants, made a coffee at that time. And yeah, since then it's been go, go, go productive. And I've only just stopped actually filming one of which okay i'm gonna i need to show you this i hope this is out do you know what i don't know if this is under embargo new limited edition bulgari harrods bag and it comes in this special box and honestly i was like oh my god it is seriously something oh, it's seriously something else this bag so it's like um yes it's a 75 year anniversary edition bulgari harrods edition how many times do you want to say edition? And look, it's, look, wait for this. It's exquisite. Exquisite. Look at it, look at it sparkling. Look at it sparkling. And it's like silver down to gold. Oh my gosh, it's heavenly. And what's, what's really cool with these bags is that you can clip these off. You get a third one inside the bag. So you technically have three lengths of chain. And what you can do is link them all together. So you can have a super long strap, half strap, or a shoulder strap like this. I'm so in love with it. I'm not, gonna, I'm not lying now when I say I might put myself on the wait list to buy this when it does come out. So um, yeah, I hope I can talk about it now. Anyway, so I've just been shooting that. I want to do like a little reel of me unboxing it and wearing it with like a cute little black dress. Just in case I can't show you that one. I also have this beautiful black bulgari bag, which is very similar. And um, well, look at this one. This is like the everyday perfect classic bag. Again, these can all be taken apart, linked together, and made into a crossbody bag. So I might actually take this tomorrow on my trip. Tomorrow I'm heading to Paris for Couture Week. I have two things on my agenda, which I'm, I'm so, you know, it's so nice. I don't have absolutely loads of stuff to do. And as I mentioned before, this year or the rest of my career is no longer about doing every little thing to keep up appearances of doing everything because actually it doesn't make me happy. It doesn't make most people happy. It's very much smoke and mirrors as ever. And I just wanna work with brands that I love and go to things that I really, really care about. So I'm heading to Paris tomorrow, Tuesday. I will be back Wednesday late, like late night. It's probably gonna be one o'clock by the time I get back. That's the idea. We have one hell of a crazy week though coming up. So there's gonna be a lot going on in this video, like a hell of a lot, but I'm gonna get packing. I can't even begin to explain right now what a tip this room is because we've just got back from Japan. I'm already packing to go away again and there's just stuff everywhere, there's stuff. So like I said, what's so nice about this trip is that I'm there for like less than, no, just over 24 hours. So I don't really need to take much with me and I'm going to attempt, I'm going to attempt to only take hand luggage on this trip. It's not something I've ever done before, but I'm going to just take little miniatures of all of my skincare, really pack down on makeup and just be really, really good. First thing. A light for filming content. There you are. I have some goodies from Merit Beauty that I want to do a bit of a makeup look with whilst I'm in Paris. So I'm taking all of those and none of them are liquids. This is, this is hard. Is a lip gloss a liquid? Yes. No. Yes, it is. I don't think so. Are you joking? I don't think a lip gloss is a liquid. Madam, you are wrong. Laptop charger. I'm not going to take my camera charger. I'm just going to take two batteries. I can't take those on the plane, can't take them small. Gold Jimmy Chews. For the Victor and Ralph show, I'm wearing a gorgeous yellow dress. So I think some really plain, simple gold shoes works. Do you know what? I might take my tiny little Chanel with me for this outfit. So it'll be like this little cute bag, yellow dress, gold heels. I like that idea a lot. Oh my gosh, she's getting her first outing. That's quite scary. And also it means I can take pretty pictures of her as well in the hotel room, so that's good. I hope I have a good hotel room. I've booked to stay at Soho. Sorry, I'm not in the shop. I've booked to stay at Soho House in Paris. Whilst I'm just staying for one night, I thought, stay there. And also the things that I'm doing are fairly close by. That's pretty much like my, my only outfit, really. 
So I'm going to the Victor and Rolf Couture show. So I've got the yellow dress, I've got the cute little gold heels. I do worry they have silver. No, they're crystal. They're not silver. It's not silver, is it? It's crystals. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Then I'm going to a Dior, Dior gym session. It's like a workout Pilates session. So I'm going to take an Adenola top. And I just want to find my Adenola bits. Where are they all though? That's the issue. Like where have I put everything? Not shorts. Not today. Oh, that's a cutie too. Maybe I'll take that one instead. Take that one instead. I just want my gorgeous Adenola top. Where is that? I found it. I found it. I remembered that I'd packed it for Japan. Didn't work out once, obviously. Um, I've got it. It's my. Fa it's just my. Fa it's just my favourite top. It's just a really flattering fit on the top. It's from Adenola, and it just cuts round. In it's just such a flattering shape. Right. So I've got full black outfit. I've got the black top, black leggings, black little over top that kind of covers me up a little bit more. So that can be that and I will take some Adenola socks as well to kind of pull up so I've got the whole look. Final things, I have this bag of hair goodies, I've just got the air wrap and brushes. So I'm going to do my hair with the air wrap but I'm not going to be able to take like all of my usual potions with me because I'm not going to have enough like liquids that I can take. So yeah, so what I need to do is I need to create one of these for, oh my god, how am I going to do that? For my actual, like, all my skincare stuff. I mean, I could just take all this because it's just all clay to pose stuff. So I could all just, I could take just all of this and then anything that's more liquid out of my makeup bag, I'll put in here too. That's what I'll do. That's what I'll do. Oh, passport. That's necessary. Just checked into my room. Soho house. It's one of their tiny rooms. So it's got this sweetest little bed. Um, yeah, this is adorable. This is so nice. It's quite strange coming away without Alex when it's just me, but I also kind of like it. it. Makes me feel like an independent woman. I also don't know why I bothered bringing so much and like spending so much packing it into my suitcase when they do give you all these little bits and bobs in the rooms. It is so handy, like get all the creams and all the things. Always such a relief when you finally get to your end destination and everything is fine. I've got a lovely dinner ahead of me. I have a meeting with the team at Joseph. Really looking forward to that. And then I'll be washing my hair, air wrapping, pin curling, ready for tomorrow. I just want to get myself all ahead of the game. Quick makeup touch up. I'm gonna swap out my YSL high tops for YSL heels. Get in the mood and all that for the night. Cool. Let's tighten these up. Love these trousers. They're so great. In fact, let me just show you properly. It's beautiful sunlight here today. So cute little tank. Don't really ever wear a bra anymore by the way. I hope that's cool with all of you. I'm sure it is. Just don't want to wear a bra. <laughs> and then these trousers so far they're just a really lightweight wide leg. So they move beautifully when you're walking. They just kind of fly and drape. I saw heels. I mean I'm gonna take, I hung up all of my things. I've got my Victor and Rolf dress for tomorrow. Look at that colour. It just sort of says Victor and Rolf. It's just such a Victor and Rolf vibe. I've known me, I've not got much with me. I don't have options. I'm going to wear my Isabel Morant blazer that I came in. Throw that over. I'm going to wear the new Chanel. I was going to keep it for tomorrow for the Victor and Rolf couture show, but I actually need a bag for tonight. So I think I'm going to take this. This is like a really sweet little piece. Got a room key in there. The airport, I put myself up a little can of hairspray because I could not fit this in my hand luggage. I must admit though, I'm quite proud of myself. I don't think I've ever done a trip abroad as hand luggage only, so well done if you are someone who can do that because I've never done that before. And actually, I managed it. Baggage didn't get searched to tell me that my mascara was in the wrong place. So I'm quite, quite chuffed with myself. I just bought a few minis at the airport that I was missing. Oh, oh wait, I still got a hair. Yeah. Always with the flyaway. my hair wow I air wrapped my hair last night before bed she said I'd wake up <laughs> like this so yeah I air wrapped it then pin curled every single curl and then I put on a, a slip hair turban to keep them all in 
and I've just taken them out to look like this. I won't be leaving it like this. Rest assured, rest assured, these will be brushed out in good time, but I thought whilst I'm doing my makeup, there's no point brushing them out yet. I might as well leave them in this very excitable state. Let's get ready for couture today. It's nice and early in Paris. I'm feeling great and I'm loving getting up early recently because of the jet lag from Japan. So the past few days I've been waking up at 5.30 in the morning and you feel like you're part of some kind of, some kind of club because it really is amazing like the amount of stuff I've been able to get done because I've been waking up at half past five. Like I've been absolutely slamming through work, slamming through tasks and then by like midday I'm like kind of done. It's great. So today I've kind of woken up at the same time again. Feeling good. Excited for today. It's going to be a bit of a whirlwind day. However, I have some new products to show you. I'm really, really excited to say I'm working today on this video with Merit Beauty. This is a paid for advertorial with Merit. Um, the first time I've worked with the brand and I'm so excited to try them. I've heard so much about this wonderful brand. It's vegan, it's cruelty free, it has a really strong focus on sustainability. A lot of the products have really fantastic ingredients inside of them and for such a luxe makeup brand, the price points are really quite accessible. I'm excited to kind of try this with you. A little slip for the night. Honestly, you should have seen me in that hair turban. I was, I was not looking fetching. So every first purchase comes with a signature bag. It's a little corduroy bag that I mean you could use this to keep your makeup in, you could use it for anything you want afterwards, but I thought it was a really sweet little introduction to the brand. It's something I haven't seen any brands do before. It brings in a bit of a fashionable element. Really sweet idea. So I just have a few of the Merit products to try out with you. Let's start with this. This is the Minimalist. Perfecting Complexion Stick. I've got the shade Cream. What I've heard about this is that it's not a foundation, it's not a concealer. It is kind of anything that you want it to be. It is that kind of skin enhancing product. And a lot of people say that you can just throw this in your bag and you've literally got everything for your complexion in one. So, I'm rather intrigued. And, lovely brush, I love the packaging. I think it's so unique, again, the use of color. Like everything is you know, slightly different colors. So let's give this a go. Be honest at this point I don't know how much I actually am going to need but as you know I'm just really liking my makeup right now to be quite lightweight and all about the skincare underneath so I've just added skincare and lots of SPF and I'm just going over the top with this now this is such a soft little brush buffing beautifully I'm just kind of gonna add it now more so in the kind of concealing areas it's so creamy super creamy it doubles up and blends over the top so nicely, like super buildable. Oh guys, this is impressive. Look how gorgeous my skin looks. It's like glowy. It just looks really, really healthy. I'm really, really impressed with this. I'm genuinely impressed. It's been a long time since I tried a stick complexion product. And this is really rather gorge. That's looking so beautifully healthy and glowy. Like, wow. Just bringing my light a bit closer to me so you can really see. Beautiful, super glowy, super healthy skin. Very, very impressed with that. Back in my bag, also amazing for bringing in hand luggage because it's not actually like liquid foundation. Okay, right, I wanna try this one. This is the Brown Volumizing Pomade. Again, lovely packaging. It's quite a good color match for me right now, actually. The brush is really nice. It's really kind of clinging to the hairs, adding a little bit of color. Mm. This is great. This is adding a really good amount of product, like not too much. Just enough clinging to the brow hairs really, really well. And you know, anything that means I don't have to draw in my eyebrow hairs is a bonus to me. My skin feels amazing. Okay, that is another really lovely product. This is going really, really well. Right, the Bronze Balm in Sen. A lovely package, little lid. Ooh, that is lovely. What a nice colour. I use the same brush as before. Oh, it's super nice. Blendable. Oh my god, it's so blendable. And it's just melting so nicely into that minimalist from before. I don't actually think I need. I mean, I could keep it like that so it's a bit more a bit more natural, but I'm just going to add, I'm gonna add a tiny bit more. Because I'm really quite li liking the way it looks. This is so super duper creamy. A bit on the eyelids. It's just a... A one makeup look with this one product, pretty much. Okay, I'm a bit obsessed with that. Look how gorgeous that is. The skin looks 
unreal now. Love the lipstick cases though. These are the lovely lipsticks. This Merit top. This is a gorgeous colour. Just don't know if I want to go a little bit more. What colour do I want to do today? This colour is Millennial Signature Lip. I also have this lovely gloss that I really love the look of in taupe. Tinted lip oil. Ooh. Oh wow, it's nice. What a unique product. I've never tried anything like this, it's really different. It is like an oil and you can feel it's like hydrating, but it goes on like a liquid lip would, but it's oily and not drying and not matte. That is so stunning, just with a bit of lip liner on that. Hello, that is the tinted lip oil. Shade stick tinted lip oil in taupe. Day Glow Highlighting Balm in Citrine. Ooh, let's see. I love, I love, 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 love products like this. It just feels almost like an oil balm. Not much colour payoff, but just that wet look. Oh my gosh. Did not expect that. And that is just, that's heavenly. I mean, look at it going on. Can you see it going on? It just has that like oil slick finish, hydrated under the skin glow. Oh. What a beautiful product. Okay, last but not least, because I know these are like the viral, viral pieces. This is the Flush Balm in Cheeky. I've seen so many people use these. I love the shape. I love the vibe of this. I'm just going to like melt that now into all of that. Beautiful bronzer, beautiful highlight balm. So I've just got this beautiful glowy face and that is so nice. I love that. It's not crazy pigmented, like straight away, so you can actually work with it. I must admit, when blushes are so pigmented that you've almost put far too much on immediately, it's such a shame when you've spent so long on your makeup. That is stunning. It's melted into all that product. Well, okay, so first impressions, genuine first impressions, because this is, this is the first time I've worked with Merit, when I give like an actual first impression here. I'm really impressed, really, really impressed. My skin looks fantastic, like so fantastic. I'm in love with this finish. I'm just gonna go finish off my eyes, put on a little bit of lip liner, but otherwise my face is done and it feels gorgeous. It feels super hydrating, like some really good ingredients in all of the products, like especially the um, Minimalist Stick. I read it's just full of like fatty acids to add extra hydration to the skin. I think it's also got a an extract, sea daffodil extract to help diminish the appearance of pigmentation and dark spots. And it's formulated without an acne triggering ingredients. So I mean, the, the fact they've thought about that and what they're putting inside in terms of like actives and ingredients are actually going to work into the skin throughout the day. I love that. Like products that like our skincare as well. I love it. Okay, I'll leave all those products linked down below. Remember, you get the gorgeous little signature bag and free shipping as well if you spend over 40 pounds. So that's amazing. I'm ready. I've brushed out my hair. It's, um, it's held like a gem, so. I did want it a little less curly, but it'll it'll fall out a little bit over time. Yeah, honestly, air wrap and pin curls, it's a good way forward. I finished up the makeup just with a kind of yellowy brown tone finish eye because I'm about to wear this beautiful Victor and Rolf dress. So I thought something in that kind of tones would be gorgeous. And then, like I said, with my Jimmy Choo gold heels and then this beautiful little... My little Chanel bag. And I've just added a lip liner, a little bit of a lighter colour to the centre, but oh, it's just, it's giving me a lot and I'm absolutely loving it. Delivery to the room. I've got an acai bowl and I've got an oat milk latte. And I'm just about to film a reel. So I've got my light. I'm about to film a reel with this. And with this. So it says 30 years of Hawk Chore. Victor and Rolf flower bomb, July 5th, 2023. So today's 30 years. Of Victor and Rolf Couture. This is going to be a really, really exciting show, I think. Given the Couture shows of previous seasons and how incredible they always are, this is the 30 year anniversary of Victor and Rolf. So this is going to be amazing. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait. My outfit of the day. Um, I'm wearing this gorgeous Loewe two piece set. I'm going to get this taken in, I think, because I feel like it's just a little bit too big. This Loewe, like, by like an inch um but it's so cute yes it's a full two-piece and a sporty two-piece set wearing my YSL heels and then this Alice and Olivia blazer 
over the top just to pull it all in a little bit. Then I have this absolute beauty of a bag with me to wear with the whole thing. It's so nice. I'm gonna get some really nice pictures. I mean, I realise I'm not wearing Dior, but there was just no time. <laughs> And I literally got here yesterday and I'm going straight to this boat. So I am wearing what I had that I haven't photographed yet. So I really love it. Full black attire and the biggest hair in the world. And we're out. Little tiny bit behind schedule. I just need to upload all my video clips for the team. Oh, but I'm ready to go to the boat. Goodness, guys, look at this beautiful room. I've never seen anything so beautiful. This is my spa cabin. Oh, look, it's exquisite. It's absolutely exquisite. This is just so gorgeous. So this is where I'm gonna have my treatment later. But in the meantime, I'm just gonna get into my Pilates outfit and then Bryony Deary is here and she's gonna give us a little Pilates session up on the terrace on top of the boat. This is just the dream, the absolute dream. I mean, they've got the Dior Prestige products laid out, and the hand soaps and lotions, and what a treat this is. We are setting off. Uh, so this is Briny, Dior Pilates session floors. I just love these yoga mats. I don't know if you saw recently, but I have one of these at home, the pink version, and it's, the quality is like ridiculous, it's amazing. So we're gonna sit and have a Pilates session on the moving boat on the scent. Like it's such a super extra concept <laughs> to have a uh, water fish on a boat. Really, really excited about this. <laughs> I'm sorry that I wasn't able to film that but with having no one here to kind of help film me it's a bit more difficult but wow what a massage I'm going to ask for the name of the masseuse because she was that good I wonder if she works at the usual Dior spas because she was exceptional like exceptional it, I really enjoyed it <laughs> really really enjoyed it right so I am now gonna head back to Soho house very quick change I need to get out my hotel room <laughs> That was the quickest change known to mankind, but I quickly got back, changed into my little yellow dress. <laughs> the light bell from Beauty and the Beast right now in this. Now I'm just gonna go get the car over to the show. morning I am back at the house I got back last night annoyingly I would have been here at midnight had it not been for a crash on the motorway unfortunately so um, I it took like an hour and 20 to get through this big traffic jam so I am a little tired today I must admit but I have an exciting day ahead I am off to Cheltenham to see the Holland Cooper team to talk about my next collection so that's gonna be really, really good fun. I always love seeing the Holland Cooper team. They're kind of just like a family now. So I'm just really excited to see them, talk through what we're doing next, talk through how everything else has gone. Today's outfit is literally my absolutely dreamy roll neck. The black roll neck, the gold buttons to the cuffs and the structured shoulders. Honestly, I just, this is one of the best things I've ever, ever made. I just absolutely adore it. I wear them constantly. I'm not gonna wear a jacket today. So this is just like the perfect thing to go on. Um, and then I'm just wearing, then I'm just wearing this Holland Cooper belt. Wide leg trousers. I really wish I'd made wide leg trousers now for my collection. But this, this is honestly just the best, the most amazing piece. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to this today. I better get off though. I'm gonna take the brand new, uh, the huge new car 
over to Cheltenham. Yeah, so I'll see you in a bit. So much to say, but I don't speak. Hey guys, okay, where can I put you? Okay, does that work? Just an unreal meeting again. To be honest, they kept a lot of that a surprise in terms of what I was going to expect to see today at the meeting. They've already got the pieces, sam samples of the autumn winter collection, and it is out of this world. It's absolutely amazing. Literally, my dream pieces. And I know I say this every time, but obviously, every season there's like a dream piece that I want to be wearing, and this is that. Quality is exceptional. It's like out of this world quality. Like the most luxury brands have quality like this. It's, it's sensational. The cut and the fit is amazing. Just everything is amazing. I, I'm, I feel so lucky right now. I have this such like gratitude and I can't believe that I'm in a position where I get to work with Holland Cooper on this incredible collection. And it's like my ideal wardrobe pieces. So that's coming. And then, spring summer 24, we're already working on. And again, oh my god, I can't, I can't even, I can't even explain how fantastic the pieces are. Sorry, I'm on my phone, my camera's dead. Um, yes, the may or, I'm gonna have to hold this. The may or may not be a, um, a new category as well maybe that we are thinking about we're just working on like colors and things yeah i just feel so lucky and i'm so excited i just adore the holland cooper team they totally get me and my style and especially my new changed style and the colors i like to wear and the fit and the drape and the cut of the pieces that i wear now they very much took that into account they know that you know i'm not so much of a pattern girly anymore they've just they just get me they just made the samples look so fantastic, so I'm absolutely just over the moon. So yeah, I'm gonna head home. I'm just thrilled to bits. Good morning, everybody. Last time you saw me, I was in the car in this position. Alex is now driving us up to Manchester. We are headed back to the apartment today. This is a huge, huge day that I've been looking forward to for, for months now. The idea today is that we're going to the apartment. We're going to be meeting Jolie. So Jolie has, has been the interior design team on this project. Meeting up and all of us together with Butch as well. We're all going to decorate the apartment. So Butch has been project managing the apartment. He's been taking collection of all of the parcels. There is so much in this apartment right now. Like the sofas there, the chairs, the tables, the dining table, the rugs, everything. It's filled to the brim and it's just everywhere. So we're all going to come in today and we're going to just dress up the whole apartment from start to finish and just make it look absolutely like amazing. However, I'm going to film that as its own separate video because I think it'll be really nice to kind of watch it back and see it as like a full thing. You won't see much of that on here. That'll be a separate video coming soon where we're literally doing a whole makeover moment. So that's exciting. Last night after I got back, so like I said, the meeting with Holland Cooper was unbelievable. The autumn collection is fantastic again it's like a limited collection it's really something special and then spring is again just just amazing i obviously will say it's going to be amazing because it's my thing but just know it's really exceptional <laughs> like it's it's just the dream like if i was to have my own brand right now this is what i would be creating so i'm just so honored to be doing this with holland cooper anyway let's just carry on on the road we are technically a little bit behind schedule but hopefully if the traffic stays if the traffic stays the way it is we should get there okay we've loaded the car up we've got a little baby in the back is he asleep no he's awake he's just staring into space that's <laughs> him it's like oh god this trip again and we've got all the bits and bobs so much i've got loads of clay depot skincare with me so that i've got like a set at the apartment we've got booze with us to celebrate this evening oh you can't see it we've got a big pedestal there in the back. Got no snacks for the ride though. Got no snacks for the ride, unfortunately. Unless we take a very quick five minute Starbucks stop oh, I don't think so. en route, but maybe not. But yeah, we will see you at the apartment. I don't want to show you too much because there's just so, so much to show you. But she's just got here with all of the coffees. <laughs> 
there's a lot going on in here and I kind of want to keep it as like a secret for the big video. So I don't want to show you too much. I'll probably show you a few little tiny bits, but like. Huge pots, new radiators, cushions, sofa. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Manchester. So um, waking up today in our new home was rather magical. This bed is absolutely unreal. We are now <laughs> questioning our own bed at home and I'm definitely going to buy all of the pillows that we have here because they're amazing. We have Vice Spring pillows. We have two that are like, I think one's called a luxury pillow and then one is like a thicker quilted pillow. They're just unbelievable, aren't they babe? Unreal. Unreal. And then obviously we have like the thickest vice spring mattress topper on top of the thickest vice spring mattress and then on the divan. I'll be able to show you all of this really soon. But yeah, I can't explain how comfortable that night's sleep was. I mean just looking around, I can't, like I said, I don't want to show you because I don't want to take it away from the big video that we're putting together. I want it to be like a real surprise and you not be like, oh, I've already seen that and I've already seen that or else that just kind of ruins it. But I'm just over the moon, absolutely over the moon. Can't believe it, can't believe this is our house. Anyway, we're going to go for some breakfast. We're going to go to Federal for breakfast, it's our fave. Uh, walk across it, it's quite a beautiful day but it's meant to be thundering later. So let's see, but we just want to get out and about and just enjoy the day. I've got some new sunnies, absolutely love the shape of these. Bulgari sunnies, Bulgari across the side. And I am back in my beautiful YSL jacket again. I'm so, so happy to be back into it. It was just too hot for a couple of weeks, but now it is a good temperature. I can get back into this again. Right, let's do it. Hey guys, I thought I'd do a really quick check in. Um, also, seeing as we're here, <gasps> check this out, it's me. In the windows of Liberty. Brian is also here. We're having such a good day. I've just been for a meeting with Armani, a meeting with Fendi, and now we're on our way to. Oh, hi! <laughs> and now we're just about to do a, um, a Larry King event. I'm having, we're doing like a customer hair tutorial hair tip session in Liberty. So I'm sorry I've not managed to check in yet. It's been a very hectic day. We've had two wonderful meetings. But we just wanted to come and see this. She's just so beautiful. Am I here too? There's me again! It's me again! Oh, I love this picture. How cool. Of the new spot for choice oil. Oh, it looks great, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Oh, how amazing. I don't think I've ever been in a shop window, have I? Um, oh no, I did a Clarence yeah, yeah. thing once. Yeah. But I wasn't in the window. I wasn't in the window. This is so cool. We need to get a picture. This looks amazing. So this is this is where we're going to be doing our event. What setup? How gorgeous is this? So this is the inside of Liberty, just off of Regent Street. I mean, you've probably heard of Liberty. It's pretty famous. Um, so we're going to have everyone sat here, and then myself and Larry at the front, and this is Sophie, and she's going to be doing the interview with us and just some Q and A's. And then over here, oh, this is what I'm wearing today, guys. Oh, it's all creased because I've been sat in my meetings. That's such a shame. And I do have my heels to put on in a second. But we just we just got here. Larry's going to redo my hair for me. But I think it's looking rather nice, actually. I air wrapped it this morning, so it's looking all, all big. This is a Reformation set. Just a silky copper blouse with a copper skirt. And I've got my YSL cream heels. But yeah, I need to steam this now. It's not looking its best. I've got a little bit hot. But all of Larry's products are all laid out, this looks fantastic. I mean, look how beautiful the packaging is. It's just so chic, liquid hairbrush, textured clay, social life cream, this is the new oil in here. Which I think anyone can like buy all the products in here when, when they come along. And yeah, Larry's just finishing up Sophie's hair. And then we'll get going, but it's just so, so gorgeous in here. 